Hello everyone. We will discuss a problem regarding steady state error. Here the problem is find the steady state error to the unity feedback system. The system G of S equal 10 into S plus 1 S square into S plus 2 S plus 10 to the input R of T 10 plus 5T plus T square by 2. This is the input and he is asking to find out the steady state header. So we have two procedures to do the any problem. First we will discuss the general method. Initial method by using this we will find out the steady state error. So here the general method is the general method the steady state error general method formula is like this that is the formula is limit s tends to 0 s into e of s the other formula is limit s tends to 0 s into r of s by 1 plus g of s therefore 1 plus this is the g of s okay yeah so we need to apply the principle to here first you know the given signal is r of t the given signal r of t is there but what we need we need r of s the r of s is first right r of t is 10 plus 5t plus t square by 2 and the required signal is r of s laplace transform of the signal by applying laplace transform 10 here 1 is there it become 1 by s 5 for t it is 1 by s square and this is t square equal 2 by s cube okay here 2 to cancel then the remaining r of s equal so for this you should common the s cube you common the s cube and we have 1 is there here s square 5 into s square is there that's why it is s and s cube s cube has cancelled this is the one so the final is the 10 s square 5s plus 1 by s cube this is the r of s next what is the g of s is there so here g of s G of S already given that is 10 S plus 1 by S square S plus 2 S plus 10 so we should modify this simply 10 S plus 10 by S square plus 20 S so not 20 S s into 10 10 s 2 into s 2 s that means this is the 2 s plus 10 into 2 20 10 into 2 20 so again we should modify this we will get 10 s plus 10 by s power 4 12 s cube 20 s square 20 s square so by applying r of s this value and the g of s this value in this above equation then the equation modify like this that is limit s tends to 0 so in place of s is there in place of s is there so yes by r of s is 10 s square plus 5 s plus 1 by s cube divided by and 1 plus the g of s is 10 s plus 10 by s power 4 12 s cube and 20 s square 20 s square so here s and s square times will be cancelled yeah oh next so we should modify 
limit s tends to 0 the remaining is 10 s square plus 5 s plus 1 and we have s square is there and the remaining part this is the LCM generally by using the LCM we have the formula this term is multiplied with this one then s square 12 s cube plus 20 s square plus 10 s plus 10 by so this is the if you common the s square from these terms you will have s square s square plus 12 s plus 20 is there is there then the s square s square will be cancelled the remaining is limit s tends to 0 the remaining terms are like this the remaining terms are 10 s square 5 s plus 1 into s square plus 12 s plus 20 by s power 4 12 s cube plus 20 s square plus 10 s plus 10 10 s plus 10 yes so apply s in all terms this becomes 0 this becomes 0 into 1 so this is the 1 and and this becomes 0 this becomes 0 into 20 by again here 0 0 0 0, 0 and 10 10 1 ja 10 2 ja then this is the 2 so therefore the steady state error value is become the 2 so this is the one method and if you observe this method this is very very lengthy method this is very very lengthy method and the signal is like this this is like this so before starting the problem first to look at the air system order sorry system type not order system type system type is 2 and this is the 2 and the order of the input order of input is maximum order is 0 1 2 2 that's why we have we have the it is possible error constant error steady state error is constant so this constant error to find out the constant error we are doing this lengthy process so finally we are getting steady state error value is the 2 this is the general method we will use the another method it is shortcut method so we will go for the shortcut method or you can take the second method we will name it as the if you use the second method for this error calculation so put it as the second method so here second method a simple method first you look at the given system once again you write the given system that is 10 s plus 1 by s square into s plus 2 s plus 10 this is the given system for this system order is so not order this is the type type 2 is the system so the given input input is for first write down the input input is so here the input r of t write the input plus 10 is one input and 5t is another input plus t square by 2 is the another input so we will take each and every input first so you can take consider three inputs combination 1 2 and 3 we have three inputs so first input 1 input 1 input 1 is 10 that is t power 0 10 into t power 0 here 
the input is 10 power t power 0 is there and compare with the system type system type is high system type is high then the error is steady state error for the system is 0 whenever the input is less than the system type steady state error become the 0 all right and go for next in second input for the second input second input is 5 into t that is t power 1 and system input is 2 system type is 2 see again system type is very high the steady state error is again 0 for these two inputs it is 0 for what about third input for input 3 input 3 if you observe here 1 into t square by 2 will be so order is 2 and it is a look like a parabola and the system type system type these two value system type both are same so we have study state error that study state error formula is a by k a a by k a here a value is 1 because it is the magnitude but we need to find out the k a k a is nothing but acceleration constant acceleration constant formula is limit s tends to 0 s square g of s so by using that so by using that we will write limit s tends to 0 s square is there the g of s is 10 into s plus 1 by s square into s plus 2 s plus 10 both are cancel then by applying limit value then we have 10 into 1 by 2 into 10 2 into 10 then 10 10 cancel is 2 so we are getting finally k a value is the 1 by 2 from this we can write the steady state error steady state error equal a by k a a value a by once again we will write here a by k a yes here a value is 1 k a is 1 by 2 so we will have the 2 so from this the steady state error value is the 2 so this is the second method this is the second method so second method is first given input divide into small inputs this is small input small input small input then for each and everything is has error or not check if there is no error there is no error so it has error check like that so after that you apply the formula you apply the formula wherever t square is there you have the acceleration constant k a is what is acceleration constant name itself it is the acceleration constant so compare with the first and second method so first method is very lengthy the second method is very logical and easy so that's why when we are doing the problems we are using we are following the second method we are following the second method that's why the second method is very very important method okay i hope all of you understand the session thank you